So another method that we sometimes ship, depending on the size of your uh, frame, is also with uh, photo corners. So for this one, um, we've already removed the PVC backing board and the black matte border in this case. So we're just going to take the matte border away for a second and we're going to bring in our poster. We're going to roughly kind of put it into a position that we think is about right. We're going to take our matte border put it back on the item. You could move it around and things to make sure that you're happy with the positioning. Once you're happy with the positioning, you're looking for an item that is kind of heavy, but soft, won't damage your item. So I've got kind of like a bean bag here. Just put it on the artwork to keep it in place, lift the mat border away. And then basically with the photo corners, I'm effectively going to peel them off one by one and I can lift the item up, slide the corner into the pocket so it's tight, and then basically stick it down. And I do that for each of the four corners. So the trick of course is to make sure that the item doesn't move while you're doing this, otherwise it'll lose the position that you originally had in mind. So that's all four corners stuck down. So I can remove the bean bag, can place the Matte board back on just to check that it still looks good. What I can do is for now just move the item away, I can bring the frame back in, and we're basically going to put the matte border back in first. Just move all of the. Then we're going to take the PVC back in with the item and place that in the frame now as well. And again, push down tightly all the black flexi tabs to keep everything in place. And again, there we go, nicely mounted poster.